The technology of using a green screen has been widely used nowadays. Entertainment and Hollywood have become legendary for using this art of illusion. Many software was developed to allow the placement of any image or video onto the green screen's background and recreate the image projected onto the video. Isa's video editor offers green screen cutout feature in its latest release, providing even the non-professionals ability to create their unique videos with this technique. When launching Isa's video editor, select your green screen video in this media library and drag it to the main timeline. The green screen cutout is available at the taskbar or on the drop-down menu when you right-click the video on the timeline. Enabling this feature brings you the setting page. If the background of your video is purely green, you will find out the background immediately becomes transparent. If you are using a blue screen video or any other color, click the color picker, move it to the color you want to key out in the video, and click again. The selected color will be immediately cut out from the video. Next, you can play with the upper boundary and lower boundary parameters of the color king to ensure the edge of the objects in the video are natural. A bit of edge feathering can be helpful to make the video look more natural. Click OK to confirm the change, and you can preview the video to check if there is anything you need to modify. Next, double click the video and choose custom image. Then choose an image and click OK. You will see now the background was replaced to the image you selected in the video. Last step, you can use the parameters in color correction to adjust the color in the video and even use the effects in the filters to make your video look cooler. When all is good, click export, save your video and share it to your friends. You can also replace the green screen to a video sample. Drag the background video to the main timeline. We will use the video we just created in these tutorials and add more elements to it. Next, drag the green screen video to the in-screen timeline. Adjust it to the same length with your background video. Now you can double click the green screen video, move and zoom it to the effect that you want. The same as done before, right click the background video and select green screen cutout. Play with these three parameters to adjust the green screen cutout effect and make the edge of the object in the video look natural enough and click OK. You will find out the green screen video is overlapped to the background video. After the final adjustment of the color correction and the filter effects, now you have this video. Look pretty cool? Now it's the time for you to use Isa's video editor to create your own video. More tutorials are on their way. Please do not forget to subscribe us and click the bell button. This is Fiona and I will see you in the next video.